Rupert Murdoch and Jerry Hall marrying. Yes. Oh. Surprised. <laughs> I must admit, when I first heard they were going out together, I couldn't, I couldn't see it in my mind because I don't know Rupert Murdoch. <laughs> I hear he's a very what do you mean? Uh, they, they've got the same what reaction as me. me. That's what I thought. For one, how no disrespect to any older man in their 80s, but can they still like perform at that age? <laughs> I have heard of it, but in the 80s, it's like I'm thinking of my granddad, like. But maybe yeah. that's there's not. I mean, there's there's medical there... help available yeah. these days, isn't there? <laughs> but, but then it's not always about that. I've got to stop thinking. Yeah, yeah. As soon as I saw him, I said, "Really? How on earth do they? You know?" There's other things that you can do, isn't yeah. there? You can go for nice meals together, yeah, go to the yeah. theatre together. And all also, of as you get older, you look for different companionship. things. Companionship, girls. You do. You look for companion, and she will have a great life with him. Oh, definitely. It's quite interesting on some I of the comments, though. Ellie says. Thank you, Ellie, for this. She said, I'm quite sure it was Rupert's sparkling personality that attracted Jerry <laughs> to the 84-year-old billion billionaire. That's Ellie's point. And then uh, Jodie says, thank you, Jodie, for this. She said, at their ages, they both know what they're getting into and we all like companionship no matter what age exactly. we are, which is true. And we all deserve happiness and I wish them all the best. And yeah. sign a prenup. <laughs> did, did you get your husband to sign a prenup? Yeah, it doesn't really mean anything, though, does it? It's not legal it in this country anyway. It cost me money to get married and more to divorce. <laughs> and I still haven't learned my lesson. And have you had to pay out each time yes. for each husband? Yes. You've had to pay. But Why at the end of the day, if then? you're happy, money's not everything, is it? I know it helps, but like you say, it's not always about sex. It's if you get on with someone, banter, having a laugh and... Well, I'm yeah. playing out. Yeah. Do you know what? I'm so good at giving advice, but rubbish at taking my own. Does it gall you, though, when you have to pay out huge amounts of money? It does, but I can earn it again. Oh, there you go. <laughs> but you see, he is, he is a very um, powerful, influential man, isn't yes. he? A businessman. And that can be very attractive as well. Yes, so, I, you know, I think, you know, the initial reaction there, particularly from the audience, which was interesting, we all kind of, when that kiss, we all went, ooh. <laughs> you know, it's interesting what women find attractive in men. And thank goodness we don't all find the same exactly. things that attract attractive. And he apparently is very charismatic and very interesting because uh, obviously he's got business contacts all over the world. He owns the station that your husband works yes. for. Yes. So Hello, she's not short of television. And then there's a light switch after all. I mean, you know, you've got dark <laughs> things. That's all right. It's she her always first brings it back, doesn't she? Oh, yeah. She always it, brings it back. It's also her first marriage because yeah. Jerry, although she was allegedly married to Mick Jagger, it wasn't legal because they were married in some island somewhere. But this somewhere. will be his no, fourth. fourth. Now, you see, that, interestingly, would put me off more somebody than their age. Yeah. Their oh, wife, wife number four, I'd go, mm, But they look at my three. CV three times. My That's CV looks shocking. Five kids, different dads, <laughs> three marriages, but I'm a good person. And would you get married again? <laughs> No, I'm staying married to Kieran. Oh, you're married yeah. to Kieran. Oh, <laughs>